The 11th Space Warning Squadron is a United States Air Force missile warning squadron, located at Buckley Air Force Base, Colorado. Mission Media related to 11th Space Warning Squadron at Wikimedia Commons The mission of the 11th Space Warning Squadron is to provide theater missile warning to warfighters worldwide. History The squadron was the first operational unit using technological procedures developed following Desert Storm for the Air Force. Commanders in Saudi Arabia pinpointed a need for more timely and accurate information on incoming short-range ballistic missiles. The technology available was accurate enough, as each Scud missile launched by Iraq was detected by Defense Support Program satellites, but wasn't intended for theater use. Commanders in Saudi Arabia needed information quicker, and with more precise targeting information for anti-missile batteries, such as the Patriot. To meet that need, the Air Force set up a research and development program called Talon Shield. The program was tasked to improve and enhance sensor processing from Defense Support Program (DSP) spacecraft to optimize space-based warning support for theater commanders. The first fruits of that study is the attack and launch early reporting to theater or alert system. Alert uses improved satellite data processing equipment and programs to speed up identifying when missiles anywhere in the world are launched. Improvements to the system have sped up this critical aspect of war fighting tenfold. The Talon Shield system was declared operational and the 11th Space Warning Squadron was activated on 1 October 1994. The squadron used infrared data from the constellation of Defense Support Program satellites to warn deployed troops in theater of short-range missile launches, as well as significant other events around the globe. The 11th also formally operated and maintained the attack and launch early reporting to theater alert system, which provided continuous surveillance and early warning of theater missiles and other threats in direct support of theater warfighters worldwide. When the mission control station was completed at Buckley Air Force Base late in 2001 as part of the transition to the Defense Support Program follow-on, space-based infrared system, the squadron mission was reduced and it was inactivated on 31 December 2002. The 11th was reactivated at Shriver Air Force Base, Colorado in December 2007. The squadron replaced Detachment 1 of the 460th Operations Group. Its new role is to operate the latest space-based infrared systems satellite payload, using a new sensor in a highly elliptical orbit to provide an increase in warning time and accuracy. In August 2016, the Air Force announced plans to relocate the squadron back to Buckley and rename it the 11th Space Experimentation Squadron. The relocated unit will focus on how battlefield commanders can use space-based infrared imagery to find enemies. Although the infrared sensors were designed to detect missile launches, they can be used to detect other heat sources that provide intelligence information. A new system will replace the ground control station the squadron was operating at Shriva. Lineage 
constituted as the 11th Space Warning Squadron on the 26th of September 1994, activated on the 1st of October 1994, inactivated on the 31st of December 2002, activated on the 3rd of December 2007. Topic: Assignments. 21st Operations Group, the 1st of October 1994. 821st Space Group, C. The 1st of October 1999. 21st Operations Group, C. The 1st of October 2001 to the 31st of December 2002. 460th Operations Group. The third of December two thousand and seven present. Topic Stations Falcon Air Force Base, later Shriver Air Force Base, Colorado. The first of October nineteen ninety four to the thirty first of December two thousand and two. Shriver Air Force Base, Colorado, 2007 to 2016. Buckley Air Force Base, Colorado, 2016 present. Topic: Equipment operated. Defense Support Program, 1994 to 2002, 2007 present. Attack and launch early reporting to theater 1994 to 2002 Space-based infrared system 2007 present Topic Commanders Lieutenant Colonel Darrell Herridges, the 30th of September 1994 to 1996. Lieutenant Colonel Suzanne M. Vortrano, December 1998 to July 2000. Lieutenant Colonel Holly Wake, 2007 to 2009. Lieutenant Col. Sean Fairhurst, 2009 to 2011. Lieutenant Colonel Lynn McDonald, 2011 to 2013. Lieutenant Colonel Thomas Colvin, 2013 to 2015. Lieutenant Colonel Brent Morris, 2015 to 2017. Lieutenant Colonel Ethan Mattix, 2017 present. Topic: Decorations and Awards. Meritorious Unit Award, the 7th of October 2001 to the 31st of March 2002. Air Force Outstanding Unit Award, the 1st of October 1995 to the 30th of September 1997. The 1st of January 1999 to the 31st of December 1999. The 1st of January 2000 to 31 underscore August 2001 Gen. Seth J. McKee Award for Best Space Warning Squadron 2009.